In the United States, going to school is seen as a basic right. Even for the less fortunate, public schooling is available. There are federally assisted programs in place, such as the National School Lunch Program, which ensures that these very same children are able to have lunch at school, either with a low cost or free meal. And this is nothing new. This program was established under the National School Lunch Act, signed by President Harry Truman in 1946. In elementary and high school, textbooks are provided at no cost. Although students are required to obtain basic school supplies, such as notebooks and pencils, higher cost items such as laptops and desks are oftentimes available to students at no extra cost. And not only are they provided here in the United States, they are actually expected. This is not the case in Nigeria. In most states, students are not entitled to a free education. School fees are in place just to attend school. So as a result, many children are not able to access the very thing that we here see as a basic right, education. Parents work hard to afford to send their kids to school, but when hardships arise and they can no longer pay, their kids can no longer attend. And that isn't even the worst part. Many of the schools do not have roofs, plumbing, or even desks for the students to sit at. Conditions are rough, and the environment is certainly not conducive for learning, but the students are so eager that they will sacrifice anything for an education. It is a way out of generational poverty, a way to make their parents proud. We here at Mission Africa are making strides towards helping provide a quality education to children in these remote villages. In addition to donating uniforms, books, desks, and school supplies, Mission Africa also chooses remote villages and works with the community members and their king to handpick 50 students to be awarded a scholarship. The scholarship is extremely competitive. It is an opportunity for school to be funded for the next six years. It truly is the opportunity of a lifetime. Mission Africa students are held at a high regard and watched over by the community. They receive amazing grades and have held a 100% high school graduation rate. 65% of our students have gone on to attend college. Our first 100 students have graduated and the third group began high school just this year. And they are all so grateful. I witnessed this firsthand when I traveled to Nigeria with Mission Africa this past April. I saw it in their smiles. I read it in the letters they wrote expressing their gratitude, and I heard it in their laughter. I felt quite ashamed. I thought of my free public schooling in Seattle, Washington. I thought of everything I had taken for granted, from the free textbooks to the whiteboards with various colored markers, and even the roof over my head. Not everyone has that. It really is a privilege. So if any cause is a cause worth giving to, it is education. It should be available to all. In the US, going to school is seen as a basic right. In Nigeria, going to school is a coveted opportunity and Mission Africa aims to make it more accessible. Consider making a donation. No amount is too small and every dollar counts. Together, we can and we will change lives one village at a time.